Music is spiritual. You know, if you don't cloud yourself and you don't like miss it, you're gonna realize it's spiritual. You can you can miss it though. You know what I mean? But if you're in tune and you're present enough, you're gonna be like, it's vibrations, it's the word, the power of the word is intense, it's real. So, so to, to try to make music and separate it from a spiritual thing, I don't think it's possible. I don't even think that you know the the, the, the actual act of music. Think about think this. About this. You going, going somewhere, somewhere mentally, 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 and you bringing and you something bring back, 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 back that people that, that aren't where you just went, went, went can hear, hear, hear in the place in that, the place that, you, that both you both are. are. Like you like go you somewhere, go somewhere. That's, spiritual. that's spiritual. Even producers, producers make music. Make Where's music? the music Where's exist? exist? They hear an A, B, C. Where does that, that until they that, play it? They bringing it down to our level of experience, but it exists already because they heard it. So to think it's not spiritual, I think is being like. You're not thinking about it long.
And these cats, they possess the ability to influence society by asserting themselves musically and creating positive cultural change. These are the disciples. Some choose to join them. Some choose to resist. Go which way you will, brothers and sisters, but remember this. The power of cultural assertion is practiced by a few. These are the song makers, the music players. They assert themselves culturally to musical forms of mystifying.
Somebody say the power of music. Take it off. 
continuous stream of sonics running in the air. Everyone keep dancing. Sonic's running in your area. Everyone keep dancing.
they need it. We are all 